As a virtual dietitian, let's face it, you've probably already thought about it. Should you hire a dietitian business coach? And what makes you think that you're ready to make this investment? In today's video, I'm going to break this down and help you ask yourself some difficult questions to make a decision and feel confident about your choice. Firstly, let's talk about coaching expectations. I want you to ask yourself, what does a coach mean to you and what do you expect out of this relationship? What are you hoping to achieve? Is it freedom? You want to make more money? What are you looking to get out of the relationship? And then most importantly, what work are you willing to do during the relationship with your coach? What role do you expect the coach to play and what role will you commit to playing during the time that you are working as a coachee with your coach? Now these should be discussion points when you're talking to a dietitian business coach. What do you expect of them and what can you what can you say that you will dedicate and do while you're in the relationship? Because it's important that you're clear and on the same page about those expectations to get the results that you want. Any relationship you have with a dietitian business coach should be about you, your goals, your journey, and your desires. So you want to make sure that the coach, the dietitian business coach, keeps that in mind. And you can learn a lot about what that relationship can look like if you book a discovery call or a sales call with a prospective dietitian business coach that you're thinking about working with. For example, if you're interested in working with me or our team, somebody from our team, you can click the link below in the description box and apply for a discovery call with me or somebody from our team and learn more about what that process looks like with us here at Dietitian Boss. What you don't want to do is hire a coach to do the work for you. More of an agency model would be when you hire somebody to build a website for you or to write your email sequences and your email copy. Now that is a different scenario than when you hire a coach. A coach usually works with you, reviews your work, and they're there as your mentor and your guide when you have questions and you need help setting goals and identifying any of the limiting beliefs getting in your way. But oftentimes there's this confusion about the role of what a coach does, which is why it's important that you ask and make sure you're clear. Sometimes people use titles, but they don't clearly describe what that title means. So it's important that you're asking these questions. Again, traditionally coaches are not gonna get in and log in for you. They're not gonna write the copy for you, meaning the words. They're not gonna set up an, a website for you. That would be a, a different called done for you service. So I think it's really clear to get those expectations out in the open and get really straightforward about what it is that you're looking for and what it is that that dietitian business coach is providing you for the service you're paying for. Typically, if you're looking for a step-by-step -step solution and a roadmap, then you might be better for a program that can offer you that step-by-step -step versus if you are coming to a coach and you say, hey, I've done A, B, and C work, can you guide me through the next steps? Or here's what I want and here's what I've created and I, I have followed somewhat of a roadmap, but now I'm feeling stuck. So of course it's your choice. You can hire a coach, a dietitian business coach at any point of your journey, but typically the most success and you're, you're gonna get the most value after you've done a little bit of the work and then you've brought that work to the coach versus you just showing up and saying to the coach, Give me that road math. And so that's what programs are created for, whether it's a group program, a mastermind program, or like our library. So I suggest if you're brand new, you're just getting started and you're super nervous about making the investment that you start in the library. And then after you've implemented and executed some of the curriculum that we offer here at Dietitian Boss, that's when you would look into either uh, purchasing a coaching package or looking into a one-off session that we offer. Because at that point, the coaching will actually help you go deeper after you've already been able to follow the step-by-step -step roadmap. The second expectation would be your learning style. And this is why personal growth is so important when it comes to progressing in your business. Think about what's the best way that you learn. Are you hands-on? Are you introverted? Where you need to really think about things and process them before you can make a decision? There's no wrong answer, but thinking about your learning style can help you understand how you learn best when you work with a coach. And if you're feeling intimidated, just working with a dietitian business coach can help you learn these things about yourself so that you can better apply how you work more productively in your business while you are growing your business. And that's really exciting because as a virtual dietitian, you can only improve when you are actually dedicating time and energy towards professional development. 
Many different coaches with many personality types can be successful. So there can be successful introverted coaches, successful extroverted coaches. There can be coaches that think big picture. There can also be coaches that are really good at detail. So I don't think there's a best personality type per se, but I do think that you as the coachee, as the virtual dietitian, need to be clear with your expectations and really think about uh, your ability to learn and reflect and improve on your skills and, and make the best use of working and investing with a coach. Also expressing gratitude can go a long way. Finally, let's talk about growth and type of coach. Are you willing to feel uncomfortable and grow? Because as a virtual dietitian investing in a dietitian business coach, that's bound to happen. Working with a coach can feel uncomfortable. It's a beautiful process. It can be a vulnerable process. And it's also a really good way for you to step outside of your comfort zone and create meaningful work as a registered dietitian. Now, a coach can help you identify your limiting beliefs, but it's your responsibility to push them out of the way, All right? Your coach is not the one that's going to be there writing affirmations and helping you practice them every day. Of course, you can do that with a coach to some extent, but you're going to have to do the homework, All right? So once the coach, your dietitian business coach helps you identify your limiting beliefs, such as you experiencing fear, you struggling with perfectionism, et cetera, you possibly overthinking things, it's your responsibility to really take that to heart and actually apply the necessary steps for you to break through for some of the things that are holding you back from yourself, which we all have those tendencies. You just want to be in a place where you're really, really ready to acknowledge that and push those barriers out of the way. Ultimately, you have to do the work, right? Your coach can't show their face to represent your business, to sell your products and services. You are going to have to do that work. And working with a dietitian business coach can be a beautiful way to help you get out of your shell. So there are a lot of benefits in working with a dietitian business coach. I just want you to understand that you will need to do the work. You will need to look within and it will be uncomfortable when you communicate and learn how to communicate assertively and to learn how to communicate what your wants and needs are. You will have a much better experience working with any dietitian business coach. If you want to get started and you're still not sure about hiring a dietitian business coach, I encourage you to first start with our library. It's an affordable monthly membership where you have access to content, which is the curriculum community who are your peers and our team, me and my team of experts to help you grow your dietitian business at various stages. And we'll help you assess where you're at. You can grab the link below. If you are ready for coaching and you want to talk to someone from our team about either working with me or one of our coaches, I encourage you to apply below. The description box will have a link to our discovery call so you can get connected with somebody from our team if you seem like a good fit. Inside of the library, you have access to over 300 lessons. Additionally, I provide you with a workbook so you can work alongside and complete exercises and get feedback to make progress in your business journey. Now we have different sections, including stages of business to help you understand what to work on next to help you progress with starting and growing your business. We also have uh, guest lectures, uh, live call recordings, and resources such as templates where we've written words for you for social media and email marketing to speed up your process. We hope you look forward to joining and we invite you to come to the library, Dietitian Boss Library, with your peers and our team and me, Libby, to help you grow your business. And if you want to learn more about this topic because you're interested in hiring a dietitian business coach and you want more, watch this next video, which goes a little bit deeper into this same exact topic.